Hey, welcome back. It is 738, 22 minutes away from 8 o'clock. They call it the ultimate. I think I need an echo for this. You do. The ultimate battle of man and machine. That was great. Thank you very much. Monster Energy Supercross returns to AT&T Stadium tomorrow. Supercross racer Martin Davlos joins us from the dirt track at Jerry World. Good morning to you. What's it like to be in, in such a, a fabulous stadium for something that's so full of fun? <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much for having me. I mean, it, this is this venue is one of my uh, most favorite one from the year. It, uh, it's incredible to be here and uh, be able to, you know, experience um, such a cool thing here in Dallas. I love this city. I'm pretty excited about tomorrow, and uh, yeah, just really looking forward to a, a great, great track of racing and um, everybody uh, being on their best. F fans know what Supercross is, but for the uninitiated, like oh, I don't know, maybe me, uh, what, what is it? Just racing around a track, or is there something more to Supercross? Well, Supercross, yeah, I mean, there's, there's, uh, there's going to be a lot of racing, a lot of bumping. You know, a lot of people are, are looking to, to get the, the win here tomorrow night. Uh, there's a, um, a lot of jumps that, uh, that we got to uh, make sure we, we do them correctly and a lot of challenging things. Obviously, the stadium holds up a lot of people, so we're expecting to have um, a, t a ton of fans to come and support and um, enjoy uh, this sport with us. Yeah, I was, I was looking on social media, and I guess last within the last like week or so, there was the, the 250 SX main event. There was a 10 rider pileup at that event. So, I mean, this can get really serious. I mean, we're talking fast, fast speed and, and some serious air when it comes to the jumps too, right? Yes, definitely. I mean, it. it you know, we, we we funnel up into a into a corner. You know, off the start, and you know, you just you got to try and get a good start so you can get a clear track and be able to do your your uh, your main event with no problems. I mean, last weekend there was a little bit of a pile up, and yeah. you know that uh, that's all. That's definitely something that you got, it's challenging. You know, and and you're competing against 22 riders, so that makes it even more challenging. How, how fast are you going? Um, well, I don't have a speedometer on my bike, but we go pretty fast. <laughs> um, mostly uh, a, a lot, a lot of jumps. A lot of jumps, huh? They're going and, fast. <laughs> now, Martin, <laughs> safe you, to say. <laughs> you're, yeah, you've never been hurt because that we your go mom really would fast, worry about also, you if yeah, you got we, hurt. You've never been hurt, have you? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. This is part of the sport. Oh. We are, you know, we are professional athletes. That's something that we have to, you know, experience, and we have to, you know basically live with it uh, but yeah mom is not very happy about this sport but <laughs> this is really what I love and uh, you know she supports that oh it sounds as, like they're revving up as long as you're happy okay all right we understand uh, your compatriots they're gonna hop on the bikes give us a little bit of demonstration and we should tell folks if we watch this because we'll never be able to talk with Martin while all that noise is uh, practice and qualifying round Tomorrow we'll start at AT&T Stadium, Jerry World, the place where the Cowboys play at nine o'clock in the morning. Bring your earplugs. <laughs> Races start at three o'clock in the afternoon. Tickets pretty affordable, starting at just fifteen dollars. Oh wow! I know, I know. And we have a link to more information. Where, where, Lauren Prisbel, would you find more information? Oh, on our website, fox4news.com. I was just thinking the kids would love that, and then I thought, oh wait. The parents would love it too. <laughs> I have a feeling you'd be watching and your mouth would be wide open like, ah, what did they just do? And Landry at three and a half would be saying, I want a motorcycle. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no, Landry. No.